Happy, happy Monday, March 1st. This is Timmy O'Neill. Thank you for joining me on Embrace Life. Um, yeah, this is your uh, daily news update, a, as well as an update on a certain GOP uh, for 2024. Yeah, you heard it here first. Trump is running again for uh, 2024 presidential primary. Um, also, uh, we hit 1,500 subscribers, and I just did Raffle Copter. Congratulations, uh, y uh, Yannette uh, Galliano uh, Cord Cord Cordero. Um, I'm t probably totally murdering your name. I'm sorry. Uh, Arizona, uh, I need you to reach out to me at Embrace Life Tim. Uh, you could tweet me with your information so that uh i can get you your eighteen hundred dollars congratulations fifth uh fifteen hundred subscribers it was uh we just hit the number probably about a half hour ago um i'm feeling a lot better because i got my uh abscess uh lanced and i got my antibiotics so yeah i'm a little sore and a little pain and a little still swollen but it feels a million times better let me tell you uh, I love and appreciate all of you guys. Thank you again for uh, being so supportive with my channel. Uh, also, shout out to my uh, affiliates and sponsors. Don't forget to get your two free stocks from Webull. Click the link below. Uh, their promotion is running until March 31st. And also, don't forget they also do a referral program. Once you're in with Webull, you can refer people and get free stocks that way. Um, also, let's talk about Tesla. Tesla, uh, at this time, is at $711 a share. Now, I originally bought Tesla at $400. Um, actually, a little bit before it was $400, but um, the highest I had bought it at was $400. So, I'm doing pretty well, uh, and so should all of you if you had followed through with um, buying around the same time last year. Um, I do see it dropping a little bit more. So there may be more of a buying opportunity, but you guys are going to want to take a look at what Tesla has coming out. It's absolutely insane between the uh, robo taxis, the robo air taxis, the autonomous driving, the power grid uh, distribution. Like you can literally take your car from home after being, uh, you know, charged up to 80%. You drive to work, you plug in at work, um, you don't have to plug in back at work, but you could literally drain that, start draining that battery driving to work, put some more energy in it while you're at work, bring it back home, and then distribute that energy into your power wall, uh, allowing you to sell it back to uh, the utility companies, which means you're making money, or you can, um, yeah, you can robo taxi out your car like uber while you're at work it's working for you so there's two methods of revenue streams out of this new autonomous uh robo taxi idea uh also keep in mind the vehicles that were not out, not able to take uploads over the air uh because there was no internet connections now tesla is uh combined with spacex is offering starlink to connect through satellite internet um, so I'm, I'm not too familiar with satellite internet, but, uh, um, I think this is worth looking into. I think this is probably a creeper into the, uh, realm of more, a higher valuation of the companies, uh, together. Um, but remember, I am not a financial advisor. I'm not a CPA, so please don't sue me. Uh, I do recreational investing, um, and I make it a very clear point to let you guys know that I'm just a recreational investor for now. There might be something coming up. We'll, we, we shall see. <laughs> uh, also, if you want to get into cryptocurrency, the market is bouncing like a baby boy freshly born. Um, yeah. Uh, Bitcoin went up to fi about 50K. Ethereum is at 1550. Um, there's Litecoin. There's um, Cardano is, is on what has been the most bullish of all. Um I do see Litecoin getting gaining some strength. I also see Eldorand um, and what was the other one? New Cipher. Those are the ones on Coinbase. I like Polkadot. I like Chainlink. Oh, Chainlink's on Coinbase too. Um, 
I'm not entirely sure I, I can endorse Gemini, which is an exchange that a couple people that I've recently spoke to have. Um, but Kraken, there's another one. Um, also, Femex. Um, a couple people have asked me, how, do, how can I get Polkadot? How can I get Cardano? Um, so hopefully that's helpful for you guys. I love and appreciate all of you guys. Ch please check out my affiliate groups down below. There's going to be a huge push soon for gold and silver. If you're interested and want to check out some of the gold packages that I offer through uh, my affiliate group with uh, Birch Gold Group, um, reach out to me directly. It's easier that way. Don't forget to get some swag for my channel. Uh, if you're interested in getting any of the hoodies, they're $60. Um, the zipper and the pouch, um, you can do any combination of the uh, images. Uh, I also have the um the celebratory uh dark side of the moon ethereum shirts um which are going to be sold for twenty dollars and uh, i love and appreciate all of you guys let me know what you guys think of uh what's going on in uh comments below and man oh man trump <laughs> trump is back at it he he's getting endorsements from the republicans uh mitch mcconnell um a lot of people saying that you know, he's going to come back with a vengeance for 2024. So, with the way things are happening right now, I don't actually see this not happening. It, it might roll his way. Um, a lot of people blaming the gas prices on, uh, you know, the presidencies. Uh, just a reminder, guys. My father's had a gas station all his life um, since high school. He literally graduated East High School, opened up O'Neill Service Center on... Um, uh, it, I think it's Atlantic and Winton. At, at, at that, oh no, you know it's Browncroft where I'm talking about. Um, you you guys from not from New York won't know anything about what I'm talking about. My dad had, has had gas stations just about all his life. Gas hiking uh, prices is going to happen, has happened, and always will happen because people can't be honest. It's not a presidency. It's no one's. You can't blame Biden. You can't blame Trump. You can't blame the economy. It's people that own their own gas stations that are hiking up the gas prices, taking advantage of the scenarios. It's always happened. There, ha It's always been a problem. Please don't associate these gas prices with politics. It's people. People that are looking out for themselves. Yes, I get it. Prices going up hurts them them not having the price go up and updates for those prices going up in time uh, listen i've had 40 years of experience watching my dad rack his brain about gas prices um so don't go pushing around biden or or, or saying you know trump left this or, it's not trump's fault it's not biden's fault it's nobody in politics's fault as of right now um it can be and sometimes will be, but for the most part, these guys, they, they, they have a franchise. They're in a franchise with a particular gas provider, and then they have to keep look out for themselves. So, you know, they're entitled to put their prices where they need, where they think are appropriate. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Um, do you think the pipeline getting shut down had anything to do with this? Because I know that sparked up a lot of conversation. Um, and now I'm babbling. So we've got our announcement for 1,500 subscribers. I will reach out to my sponsors again and see if we can endorse uh, another giveaway uh, at 2,000 subscribers. So I'll keep you guys updated. I love and appreciate all of you guys. Have a great Monday. Have a great week if I don't talk to you. Um, please consider liking and subscribing my channel. Uh, just smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and, and, and hit that bell for notifications. You'll enter to win um, my giveaways. Um, remember, I use Rafflecopter, uh, so you have to leave a comment uh, with this being a subscriber. That's how, that's how they, they, they work, uh, the metrics work on this. Um, you know, it's great that you uh, are watching, and I love the support, and I love and appreciate all of you guys. I wish you all well. I also want to throw this out there. I'm going to start doing on uh, either Thursday or Friday. I know I don't do m many videos on Thursdays, 
but uh, one of these days of the week, I'm going to choose and designate a small business by representing and showing off their swag. So if you guys have a business and have some some uh, you know like hats or or hoodies or something with your your business name on it, and you want to promote it, reach out to me at Embrace Life Tim. I'm happy to uh, you know salute to your business. Uh, as, as you're starting anew with an uh, entrepreneurial um, spirit. I think you I think we all could use it. I'm going to start off probably in the next one to two weeks um, representing uh, or showing off you guys your guys businesses. I know there's a lot of you guys out there that have your businesses all set up and, and whatnot but it, and that it could it never hurts to have a little help and I'm all about paying it forward so, uh, I, I'm, I'm actually going to re- reach out to some of my close friends that I know are, are in need of support and see, you know, what they think about putting out um, some swag that I can show off their business. I love and appreciate all of you guys. Let me know what you guys think of in the comments below about that idea. Um, congratulations again, Yannette. Uh, I love and appreciate all of you guys. As always, we'll be talking soon.